Welcome to Essential Style. Just got home from work. Hope everyone's doing pretty well. Just getting over here to the Essential Studio. Quick video today. Quick summer tip. It's been pretty hot here in the New York area. There's been a couple of days where it reached, I think, about 90 degrees with some pretty serious humidity. So we're definitely in it and I'm very, very happy. I don't miss the snow. So let's get over here to my beautiful background. So if you look at what I'm wearing, long pants, long sleeve shirt, it looks like I'm sweating, right? I'm actually not. Reason being is because I've got a linen shirt on, which is super breathable. And I also have cotton chinos on. And then footwear is footwear, but as long as you don't try to wear, for example, an L.L. Bean boot or any type of winter boot in the summertime, your feet will be fine. You know what I'm talking about. The tip basically is, it's all about choosing fabrics that are more breathable than the fabrics that you would wear in the fall, winter, and spring months. I'm a big fan of the button-up shirts, and who doesn't, I mean, who doesn't love a good pair of jeans? But I find that there's kind of like a point in the summertime, no one's over there, I don't know why I keep looking over there. There's a point in the summer where it gets to a certain point, the weather gets to a certain point where I end up, once I put on my linen shirt, once I just start wearing my khaki chinos again, or cotton chinos rather, khaki is the color, not the actual material of the pants, that's it, there's no going back. And it's the same thing on my days off when I'm not going to work, I just wear shorts all the time. Once I start wearing shorts, that's it. No more denim for me in the summer. And it's the same thing in the fall. Once I just start wearing denim, that's it. I don't, I don't stop. So anyway, so overall, you can pretty much see it doesn't look like I'm ready to go to the beach or it doesn't look like I'm ready to do anything or I'm ready to go outside in super hot, humid weather, right? Everyone wants to see a short sleeve shirt, a polo shirt, a t-shirt, you know, put on your t-shirt and shorts, put on open-toed shoes, flip-flops, which those I think are for the pool only, but that's another, that's another discussion, another video, another time. But yeah, I mean, it's all about choosing fabrics that are a little bit more breathable. Once again, linen shirt, cotton chinos, boots, summer boots unlined. My feet aren't sweating. I've got on some cotton athletic socks and I'm super comfortable. You know, I'd probably be comfortable up to 100 degree weather, and I should mention 100 degrees Fahrenheit, even with it, if it's humid out. Sure, you're gonna sweat, but it's summertime, you sweat all the time, so that's it. Hope I helped. Just keep an open mind. There are pros and cons to linen, pros and cons to wearing, there's pros and cons to everything in life. And I will do more videos going into more detail of my general opinions and my advice on how to pick materials in the summertime to help you just stay looking great as, as well as being comfortable because anyone can look great but some of these materials especially polyester polyester blends are like super super not breathable at all and you'll you'll stand here you'll just feel yourself sweating it's just it's no fun at all so and i'm telling you i mean if i was in my cotton oxford shirt and a pair of denim every time i move i'd be like ooh, it's it's hot out today it really does make the temperature feel like it's about five to ten degrees low so quick video that's it let me know what you guys think thanks for stopping by